As 55% of people above the age of 55 complain of knee pain at least once. The tragedy here is there are only 3 or 4 up in this age group. Everybody is young. So make sure that when you are 55, you don't end up into this group. So why do you get this knee pain and what we are going to discuss basically in this lecture is why you get this knee pain that every 55 year old will get it sometime. What are the various treatment options? Uh, how do you prevent uh, this from happening? What is the importance of diet? What is the importance of exercises? What is the importance of mental health? And finally, if everything fails, then I am the last resort. I can operate on your knees and give you a new knee. So, you have to understand our knee looks something like this inside. And the blue part you see in the picture is actually like the inner side of a tender coconut. So, it is smooth. That's why your joints work very well. So when we age, what happens is that these smooth parts starts developing cracks and it becomes irregular. And finally, that is the time when you start getting pain. The last stage is that the whole cartilage goes off. There is no smooth part and that is when we call the knee is gone. So when you start getting pain, uh, this is the smooth part is getting now small, small cracks. So what happens typically in a person of 55? They get pain on the inner side of the knee most of the times and then they start finding it difficult to climb stairs like this. They look for supports. They are sitting on the floor and they want to get up. They want to hold on to something or ask for help. So this is what happens occasionally. Uh, they see the swelling around them. So what does a typical person do? He self-medicates, as he rightly said. Or if that doesn't work, the next door neighbor gives the pill which his doctor gives, saying that he kaam karta hai, wo doctor ne diya And then if that doesn't work, then the next step starts. Very few people then think that I should get an X-ray done. Uh, gap ho gaya ho gaya. That is what is their own diagnosis. And again, after the X-ray, nobody is consulted. A new course of medicines is started. Then some neighbor comes and says that, Mere ko na wo physiotherapy se achha hua tha, tum physiotherapy karo. So without any doctor consulting, they end up doing some kind of weird physiotherapy. Uh, if it works fine, the story ends there. But normally the pain comes back. Then a new course of medicine is tried and the course goes on. Now what happens is that the pain has come back. Neighbor's medicine has not worked. General practitioner's medicine is not worked. So this allopathy is a bakwase. I'll try Ayurveda. So the next cycle starts with Ayurveda. If they are lucky, the Ayurveda helps them. If not, then Ayurveda be bekare. Then the homeopathy starts. So the pathi starts. Then the next course is that to use fancy belts. Because kneecap to sabko pas hona hi Without kneecap to nothing will work. But if you realize still this stage, no qualified doctor has been consulted. Because orthopedic surgeon ke paas jayega, kya likha hai? Surgeon, operation ko lega. Mere ko nega. So what happens is the qualified people are not consulted even at this stage. Then the next step is that local gel, sum laga ka. Now all the local gels are actually same. But if you rub and they become hot, then they are hit. Everything which is hot is hit. If you apply ointment and it doesn't cause any burning sensation, they are. So actually, people ask me, doctor, what according to you is the best ointment? So I tell them that the best ointment is any ointment which is applied to wife by husband and vice versa. But what is the reality? You go for online shopping and you have this Sandhi Sudha tablet or Sandhi Sudha oil. This is the oil. You know how much it costs? 4,000 rupees for 5 bottles. But calm kare. So this same thing if you go and buy a simple Ranbaxi's brand of Bolini or Moo which is advertised costs around 45 rupees. So people start spending money from early stage on useless things. Because this is not marketed, it is 45 rupees. Sandhi Sudha is magic. So it is 4000 rupees and no jokes. It is 4000 rupees for 5 bottles of 100 ml. And it is going to cure your old knee. Then what happens next is that the bed. Now kneecap is very sad. Na? Uh, to 50 rupees ko milta hai, 250 rupees ko milta hai. So then what happens is they start looking for beds which will cure their knee better. If they are educated, they go for fancy online beds which cost around 35,000 rupees. 35,000 rupees. Now, what happens is people are clever. Now, the standard braces which we apply is from a company on the right hand side cost 250 rupees. But there is one very famous fellow. Now his camps have stopped. This was called as the brace I am showing you is a brace called Nike brace. And this
place where I used to hold cabs and around thousand people used to stand in lines. And that motto was that ये बेड पहन के नीचे बेड के सब कुछ कर सकता है नमाज पढ़ सकता है so you used to they used to use a character who could sit in नमाज position and this belt was manufactured so badly no nothing absolutely horrible mechanics eight thousand rupees and people used to stand in lines to get this belt hoping that my knee will get better then you come to medicines. Now, why you should not take any medicine? Because the next door never will tell you, Combi Flan and Ameriko Chalke, or some other medicine because my doctor gave. The problem is that all painkillers damage your kidneys. So, without a doctor's advice, please never ever take medicines. Then, there are people who give this powder. This magic powder works. The magic powder finally we decided to test it in KM Hospital and found that it was powdered steroid. So, steroid will give all relief, but it is steroid, so it's like habit forming. Then there are Sandhi Sudha type of miracle drugs, which you must be seeing in every newspaper, or now they are available online. But what you have to remember is that in case you have knee pain, you don't have a doctor nearby, you take simple paracetamol, which is nothing else but crocin tablet, doesn't damage your kidney. But if you look, <coughs> then these are pain mukti tablets. Okay, these are miracle drugs which will cure your arthritis. They cost 300 rupees a bottle for 50 tablets. Okay, but people will buy this. Then all of them have got relatives in US. See, the um, India may kuch nahi bil. The US may there is magic medicine. So this is what he said. It is a drug called glucosamine, which will come in this fancy bottle from US from a doctor. Doctor ne bheja isi achha. This same medicine is available in our chemist shop for around 30 rupees. This will cost around 3000 rupees, but we are a daughter and a US excess basic measure, so this is good. But plain paracetamol or crochet tablet cost not even 1 rupee, nobody will take it. Jitana venga, utana acha. So that is the whole story. Then sometimes we tell them you exercise. We exercise to barjana parta na. So they got this new machine called morning walker. So you sleep and your legs are moved by machine. Four and a half thousand rupees, very popular. Or bar dhup me marne ko jaye. So this is what happens. But a nice gym, jisse sach me farak hoega si, nobody is there. So all the gyms are empty. But morning walker sells like a hot cake. If you can buy, if you don't want to go to the gym, okay, you can buy a stationary bicycle at home, which can cost as less as two and a half thousand to good one around thirty thousand rupees. You can exercise daily. वो सास बहू का सब सीरियल इसके ऊपर बैठ के अच्छा लगता है। You can cycle and see TV. No, they won't buy this because इसमें सच में फायदा होता है। So then we tell them exercise. This is all the thing. Then they don't realize that exercises are good because there are no side effects. No, no side effects. Have you heard side effects of exercise? No. Does the does any exercise cost you any money? No. But it's not marketed. No, it is not available online for three thousand rupees. So exercises are bad. So the first tip for you to take home is that you may be in the last stage of arthritis about to require a knee replacement exercise. Exercise is the most important part which will help you in any stage. Fortunately, no side effects. It is not marketed. That is the problem. So what we say is that bottom line is exercise wherever you want. You may be as fanatic as this. Of course, this is not the Bombay metro or Bombay locals. There you can't do this. You can't even stand. So forget exercise. So then it comes to physiotherapy. So what are the myths of physiotherapy? Dr. Anjana will tell you 200 more. But this is what I realize. When I tell them physiotherapy, Haan, mera bhi yoga class mandir mein hota hai. Jau, wo hai na. So they feel physiotherapy and yoga are same. They are not same. Physiotherapy take 8-9 years to qualify. And there are qualified people who will tell you exactly what to do. But no. This is, uh, yoga is good. Wo Baju ka Markandeshwar mandir mein free class chalta hai. Every Wednesday I go there. The next thing is that physiotherapy means what? I go to Dr. Ranjana, I take 10 sittings and I come back and then I won't do anything. It is ongoing. It is an exercise which you have to learn and do it. Then they feel that physiotherapist that have a light that they have. Light is both side effect of that. Light to very dark may be here. Infrafield light is light. So the physiotherapist have got lot of new machinery which aids in giving you pain relief. It gives you lot of muscle function. But no, physiotherapy ke was light hai ho. एक सिटिंग को पांच सौ रुपए लेता है इंफ्राफिल लाइट खरीद के मैं ही लूंगा करने। सो लाइट्स आर बेड। सो दिस आर मिड्स अबाउट फिजियोथेरेपी। 
But physiotherapy has got two things. They can relieve your pain by using a lot of different machines and mainly give you exercise so they build up the strength. We spoke about elderly joints, they can't become new. But you can make your muscles stronger even at the age of 80. So physiotherapy is a very important part. Of course, Dr. Anjana will talk more about it. I'm just telling you about the myths. But Dr. Anjana ka fee to 400-500 rupees hoi ga. Yeh dekho. This is best, no? Hath bhi nahi lagane ka. So this is the ad. It's, it's, it's in a paper where I picked it up. 15 minto mein ilaj kutne pe hath bhi nahi lagane ka. And sometimes they write paisa wapas agar nahi milega to. And this is how they treat. This is next to our famous hospital. Okay, hardware. Which will go to hardware and go to the hardware. Then there, is, there are smarter people. Vets are uneducated people. Educated people. So this is now going down. But this was a very high thing called as magnetic resonance to treat your knee pain. And this was marketed by a brigadier of Indian Army. So everybody used to be a brigadier army. But this was the most focus focus and one set of sittings used to cost you 18,000 rupees. So this fortunately has gone down, but people have spent around 60,000 rupees where they actually should have spent that 60,000 in a knee replacement. Then there were new fans. This surgeon went away from Nanavati after a while, but this was in Nanavati, Mumbai. First surgeon to do knee resurfacing. There was no technique like knee surfacing. This was a website and people were charged two and a half lakhs. Luckily in six months it went away. Then you get these fancy books. So this is a recipe where arthritis can be cured by just cooking well. So another fad. Then this is a new thing. If you see WhatsApp, goes, this is a fad where this diet can cure your diabetes. Okay? And the diet says that you have to consume food only twice a day. So aapko jab bhook lagta hai, bara baje tabhi ek bar khane ka, aapko das baje khane ka. Char tomato ka slice khane ka, 45 minute bhoomne ka diabetes good. But you don't know, this diet is currently followed by every single person next to you. Ask around, you will find at least two people following this diet. Then there was gluten free diet. All these diets were analyzed and realized finally that all these diets are fats. None of the diets will actually cure you about anything. Rather, they create more medical issues and more deficiencies. But this is the current craze called a Chagandhan Dikshit diet. He is a doctor by the way of preventive and health medicine. You see on YouTube videos after videos. There are 99 WhatsApp groups following his diet. What is our popular look? Then you go to these funny Vedicure clinics. You know, there are clinics called Medicure, Vedicure clinics. So I went and asked what does it cost. So you get this Panchakarma and Basti. My own aunt went in Pune. She said she was told that your knee is bad. You require total 40 sittings, 3 a week. Paila paisa bhardega to bis takka discount. But this cost 55,000 rupees. You do these magic cure clinics where they charge you 1 lakh for a 50 sitting. No guarantee. There is no negative publicity. And people fall for this because every paper has these ads. And there is no regulatory body. A doctor can be sued. These people cannot be sued. So these are the new things. Now coming to the second message. How many of you know that actual footwear helps in your knee pain? No. So you see ladies, sorry all the ladies sitting here. The ladies spend around 25 minutes deciding, Dr. Rajesh, am I right 20 or more? Probably more time selecting the sari. So what happens is that you take the sari, look under this color. Then you go out, look at the color in the bright sun. Then you go inside and then decide what color. So when you ask, then you say no, this is better. Better, correct. So all husbands know how much time is spent in buying a sari. But how much time do you spend buying a footwear? Footwear are what we call as all linking road footwear. You buy anything in linking road or market and it works. But footwears are important and they load your body, they unload your body. So taking good quality footwear is very expensive footwear is actually a good investment. But footwear is not marketed. So what we do now is that we have new technology where we can see these are the feet of four different people and you see the red area is the pressure they are taking. So the extreme left is the normal foot where you should see the weight distribution and somebody who has got a very bad flat foot is on the right. 
So they need to be customized. So they can be evaluated and we can create an insole for them where the foot pressure gets properly distributed. So the second important message is that spend a lot of money on your footwear. Can anybody in this room tell me what is the best time to buy footwear? Have you ever thought about it? Anybody? Sunday morning. Morning. Anybody else? Any other thing? Sir, any time. Any time? Like sari, any time? Yeah. Or, no, actually to the, there is a time. So you need to buy your footwear between 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. So what happens is that your foot size is maximum between that time. And if that fits you well, it will fit you well at all other times. So that's why you feel that your feet are swollen in the evening after use because we work against gravity. So nobody even knows what time to buy. So always buy your footwear between 4 p.m. and 6 p.m. Not any time. And pay a lot of attention to what you buy. So that is the issue of footwear. So now, after 20 minutes of discussing all these things, then the patient thinks about me. That abhi sala jana padega. Kuch bhi nahi ho raha hai. Then the orthopedic surgeon is consulted. Otherwise, all these other things, by the time we are consulted, around a lakh of rupees are spent most of the time. So what do we do? But no. Why we are asked for? We are asked for this injection. So there is a new fad called as platelet-rich plasma therapy. Okay? We commonly call it patient-rich plasma therapy. The rich patient is given to because it costs a bomb. The funny thing is that this PRP is given even for hair transplant. It is given to dissolve fat. It is also given to resolve your knee pain. So we get a lot of queries. Platelet-rich plasma we do use in orthopedics, but there are limited indications where it can be used. But nowadays all patients feel that this is a magic. So I have been advised the knee replacement surgery, platelet-rich plasma they take, it will happen. Enhanced scrupulous people charge around 30,000 rupees for one injection. What they do is they take your own blood, separate the plasma and inject it. So it doesn't look like money. No investment but 30,000 to 40,000 rupees. So then they ask us for other injections. Now the only thing which we can inject is scientifically we can inject the same lubricating fluid which you have in your knee. So scientifically we are able to actually make the same fluid in the lab and it is available in an injection form which we inject inside. It actually uh, creates the new lubricating fluid inside. So it comes by the name of Synvis Quanta. So this is the only injection which should be given which is useful. That too in limited cases costs around 15,000 to 18,000 rupees, but one injection usually solves your problem for a year, year and a half. But this one is not market. Platelet rich plasma is market. Then people take steroid injections. Okay, at least not much of a harm, but you can't keep taking steroids frequently. We used to give this around 20 years ago. Now rarely we use it, but we still use it. But with a doctor's consent. Then if they come to us and we say surgery, oh, surgery, nahi karne ka. So this is how their expressions are. They feel surgery means it's laser surgery. So people have this funda that anything with laser is good. So they ask me, knee replacement laser se karega na? So we tell them that there is no laser surgery in knee replacement. It's an open surgery. But actually what laser means is we put telescope and do arthroscopy. So limited cases where you come early, we may be able to help you with arthroscopy. In some patients, we, what we do is you see a lot of patients with bow legs. So we can do a surgery called osteotomy where we can correct the bowing and make them straight. So it's not only knee replacement, we can do a lot of other surgeries as well. Then we can replace cartilage. Not many people know that our cartilage can be grown in a lab. So suppose you lose that cartilage which I showed in the first slide. We can take your cartilage cells, grow them in the labs to whatever quantity we want and we can transplant the cartilage back in. You hear about kidney transplant and liver transplant but we can actually transplant cartilage been going on for the last 10 years, but people are not much aware of it. So this cartilage replacement is also available. But then normally patients come to us when they are like this. You know, the legs are so crooked they look almost at 90 degrees. But luckily our technology is so good that even those we can correct and make them straight. Sometimes they wait so long that they break the bone below because of loading. This is not because of a fall. The lady broke because she was waiting for surgery too long. Even if this happens, we can treat them, we can get the knee straight. But People keep delaying surgery and they start falling and then they usually come with complications. They never come very early to us. So what are the myths? Uh, why they don't come? They feel that joint replacement, 
वो क्लियर है वो वाजपेयी तो देखो कभी चला ही नहीं सो अटल बिहारी वाजपेयी थी मैक्सिमम डैमेज टू ऑर्थोपेडिक प्रैक्टिस he had another problem by which he could not walk but people used to blame his knee replacement that he never walked uh, the knee remains stiff they can't bend the knee you can't sit on the floor you can't squat um, it, it, it's more money i spend then only it will be better but what has happened is that um, i have heard bad results with atal bihari bajpay so all these things scare them so this this these are the patients when uh, we operated 20 years ago they can squat they can sit cross legged they can do anything and in 20 years the joints have evolved so you can actually do anything we have patients who play tennis even after 60 after the knee replacement so it's a myth that you don't require a joint replacement uh when we say surgery then no to sab surgery apne mar jayega how safe is surgery so nowadays the surgical techniques the anesthesia is so safe that if you are advised that you should feel like this baby how safe this baby must be feeling exactly the same amount you should feel uh, safe when you are undergoing the surgery so what we basically try to tell you in these uh, programs is that don't go after this meds don't go, don't go for fancy cures if you come early to doctors all the things uh, happen quickly realize one thing that all of us are going to grow old so age gracefully there is no point coloring your hair when you are you know, old uh, accept it gracefully that one day you are going to be gray exercise is not marketed but exercise daily people feel that i can't spend money at the age of 18 a knee replacement costs around 2 lakh rupees but you plan for your uh, kids future so similarly we ask you to sit with a financial advisor and plan a health fund so god forbid you have a problem in medicine then go ahead and you know utilize that fund so everybody should save for old age and finally what is important is your quality of life at 70 it doesn't matter whether you are going to live long for 20 more years but whether you are going to be happy for next 5 to 6 years so give importance to the quality of life and whenever a decision is made make sure that you ask qualified people and take a informed decision people you will ask their next door neighbor my kya karu but they don't realize this next door neighbor who worked as a clerk in bmc for 20 years also sits there and tells sachin tendulkar how to lift a shot but for them he is an expert so don't believe on such experts but ask the real experts so i usually end the talk with a famous quote from mark twain is that when you grow old then you remember mark twain's quote age is strictly a case of mind over matter if you don't mind your age then it doesn't matter and that is what we are going to talk about mental health as well but this is all about the myths from a surgeon's point of view thank you very much